Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a little bit of a vlog. I have already started filming it. I think it's going to be over a couple of days, potentially. It depends how organised I am. But it's a little pack with me slash holiday prep slash just me running around and getting things done before I go away. I'm going to Turkey on Friday, it's currently Wednesday and I've got a few things to get done so I thought I'd just bring you along with me and I really hope you guys enjoy it, please let me know if you do and I am vlogging in Turkey so that, that video will be up really soon, probably next week and I hope you guys enjoy. Good morning, so it is 9.23, I need to go out in like seven minutes, <laughs> half past nine, and the first step of this prep is going to the gym, gym classes. Now, I'm not saying you need to go to the gym before you go on holiday, um, and you need to get that summer body, that's not what I'm saying, but I have been going to the gym um, on and off for like years, but for the past couple of weeks, I've been going every day because I just want to feel better and I want to feel good in what I wear when I go away so yeah I am counting that as a little bit of prep um and yeah just to feel good um I thought I'd just show you my new gym wear I got this from Honor Active Chrissy um and her team sent it to me so thank you so much I love the colour and it feels so nice um and I'm gonna wear the t-shirt as well straight from the gym i am actually going to go and get my nails done um they are short right now i've just been giving them a little bit of a break um before getting them done because i just can't do gels on holiday they just will not last with like the water and the heat and stuff so yeah i'm gonna go get acrylics i'm not sure what yet i'm leaning towards white or something which is kind of random for me and like something i'd go for back in the day um but yeah i'm just thinking of something simple and white always makes you look tanned i'll try and film in there um i don't think i'm gonna get a pedicure unless they're really quiet because i had one done like last week basically the rest of this prep will be packing i am not going to get my eyelashes and eyebrows done for this trip um just because i i want to give my eyelashes a bit of a break and i did just have my eyebrows tinted by my sister as well so i might put another layer of tint on because that made such a difference i don't know i just feel like i can't do it for every single trip otherwise i would just probably be on like a rotor and never give them a break i'm gonna get those done but just my nails and yeah i've got a long list of stuff to do today so let's go to the gym actually going to um gym classes which is what i do on a wednesday so let's go Okay guys, so I am back from getting my nails done. I did film a few snippets, but I just went for French in the end. I sat down and I knew I wanted them quite long and square. Um, and then he gave me the colours and then as I was looking through the colours I was like oh no I just don't know what I want and I didn't really fancy any nail art and also I didn't want to sit in there for hours so yeah I did want something simple but I decided to go for French and I really really love them um, they're quite long and very like old school French but no I really like them and I feel like they are perfect for holiday um, so yeah, that is my nails all done and sorted. Have just got ready as well um, because why did I get ready? 
because I need to film the intro for this video and also the intro for another video. I've got a little bit of makeup and I thought I would just show you a few bits that I picked up in Primark the other day for my trip. A little Primark haul included. I apparently can't stop shopping even though I have so much stuff for going on holiday. I just can't help myself. So um, yeah, I went into the Oxford Street Primark um, like last week when I was in town and I picked up a few bits that were very cute and I couldn't resist. Um, so yeah let me show you so i picked up this um underwear set they do the comfiest sets there's no wires or anything they're just like sporty style and i do have this in like a gray but they brought out some spring colors so i got this in this color and also um like a blue turquoise color but i have already worn that so it's in the wash and five pound for the set i just think you cannot go wrong then I got the cutest little dress and I just thought this would be so nice to chuck on by the pool. It's definitely like a vintage style, um, kind of like what you'd wear when you're young. But it's like a mini dress, kind of tight, but I got it in a 12, yeah. I didn't want it to be like too tight fitting and it's quite stretchy. So hopefully this looks nice on, I've not actually tried it on. But this was £11. And it says, good vibes, and I just love it. I think there were so many cute pink and orange bits in there. Um, and I also thought I could wear that with this. How cute is that? It's a little pink bucket hat. I mean, I'm not gonna put it on properly because I've got my hair up. <laughs> but um, I, ha I had a white bucket hat on um, when I went to Thailand, and <laughs> it looks so stupid right now. But I will put it on properly when I actually wear it. Then I picked up two pairs of shoes. The shoes in Primark at the moment are very cute. I got these pink slides. They are like um, like a woven style. So yeah, I got these in pink. They did have them in a few other colors, but I don't have any pink shoes. And I told you there's a lot of pink right now, but I just thought they'd be so cute for on holiday if you're wearing like a neutral outfit. Um, and a lot of my slides, like I do have these ones that are also from Primark, I think. Um, like they're neutral, but sometimes you just want a statement colour. And then I got these ones as well. I think these will add such a nice pop to a neutral colour. They are like Bottega, Bottega green. Um, and this strap is actually like kind of stretchy. So I think they'll be really, really comfortable and I have tried them on and they seem like they are as well. So these were eight pounds and the other ones were six pounds. But yeah, I really love those. And then the last thing I got was a beach bag because I'm sure I have so many beach bags somewhere because I definitely recall buying some or having some in the past, but I have no idea where they are. Maybe I've accidentally given them away or I don't know, maybe they're at my mum and dad's, but I've been using like my canvas tote bags when I went to Thailand and I thought I need to get like a proper beachy bag so I got this in Primark and they have loads in there um, this one was £10 and I just thought it was really cute it does have a long strap as well and that is everything I got in Primark um, my plan now for the rest of the day <sighs> I feel like those vlogs going to have to be over a couple of days now because um, I'm actually going to my sister's. She's going to do my hair. I'm gonna get a little bit blonde put through. Also like a little bit of a trim. I think I want like my fringy bits a little bit shorter as well. So that's my next bit of prep. And I think I'm actually gonna do her hair as well. Um, favor for a favor. Then I think I'm gonna stay for dinner as well, which will be really nice. And then depending on what time I get home, I will start packing. And my case is still under my bed. But, mm -hmm. yeah, it's fine, right? I've just done your hair, Charlotte's hair. And um, this is my hair before. And I don't think I'm gonna get it cut because I don't think it needs one. When did we last cut it? It's not that long. But I'm gonna get my fringe cut. And just some blonde through the front. Oh, 
You being a silly boy. Okay, though. You being a silly boy. He's a good boy. He is the best boy. He's gonna have a fresh cut he Saturday next week. He looks like he's had a cut already. Look <laughs> how cute he looks. He's a good boy. He's such a good boy. Can you look at the camera? Look at the camera. Hair. <laughs> I just had a lot of scattered through the front mainly so I think I'm gonna look a lot blonder which I'm very excited about we're watching the Kardashians um, on Disney Plus I've actually watched all the episodes but Charlotte hasn't so yeah we're catching up on that this is gonna um, develop is that the word yeah and then I'm gonna wash it off and we're gonna have dinner prep is well underway it's now the next day and this is my hair I mean it's not actually completely dry um, and obviously I've not done anything to it, but I think I look a little bit blonder. Well, I do. I've got my friend shorter again. So, yeah, if I have some time later, I'm going to style it a little bit, put on some makeup and, yeah, show you what it really looks like because I just feel like you can't tell when I'm not, like, you know, done up. I really like it, but my plan now is to actually start packing. It's official. I go on holiday tomorrow. And I've only just got my case out. <laughs> yeah, I think this might be one of the most last minute packing sessions I'm ever going to have to do. I have been busy this week, but there is a few times I could have done it. I just feel like I might as well just bang it all out today, you know? I've got tuna on toast, by the way, with some tomatoes. I'm going to start packing. But I did want to um, show you that another order came today. Another order? Oh. I showed you my Primark stuff yesterday. Um, and I've got more stuff to show you because I did an order of um, this place called Cider. I kept seeing it on my Instagram, the little ads. And I was like, do you know what? Their stuff actually looks really nice. And I saw this set in particular, I'll show you. And I was like, oh my God, that looks unreal. Are we perfect for holiday. Actually, at one point thought I might be being scammed. <laughs> Because it took like a week to come. And then on my tracking it said that it had been delivered somewhere else. Um, but I came home and it was outside my door. So yeah, it came and it's a real website, thank God. But I got a couple of things because I wasn't sure like what it was going to be like. And I got this cord. It's really, really nice. It's like a yellow, it's a bright yellow with a big slip and some lining and it's got like a zip at the back so it's like a long skirt and then also this little top i just thought that was really nice um i'll pop a picture up of it on the model because yeah i just it just wanted i wanted it straight away and it just has really nice like unique bits on there so i actually really recommend also got a couple of bikinis there's like a it's actually like velvety um, but it's just like a multicoloured one and obviously some bottoms and it kind of reminds me a bit of Shein, Shein, whatever you want to call it. And then I just got this um, triangle one because I love that you can wear these like multi-way um, and the quality honestly feels really, really nice. If you're really impressed, I would definitely shop on there again. Um, so yeah, I just got two bikinis and the cord and i got them in mediums let you know what i think when i actually put them on because i've not tried them on but i'm just gonna pat them and hope for the best the other day i went to <clears throat> my voice i went to an event um with lancaster and this is perfect perfect timing none of this stuff i'm mentioning is an ad by the way um just very kindly gifted and yeah it's perfect timing because they gave me so much spf so I was actually going to like include me running out and getting some last minute bits like sun cream and stuff in this video but turns out I didn't need to. So yeah we've got like, I'm all stocked up with um, Factor 50, Factor 30 and 
interesting fact about this brand is that um she did something about the royals using it like sun protection is like let's say like 10 different things like uv uva visible light loads of different like factors of sunlight and sun damage and most sun creams only protect you for like two of those which is why a lot of people still burn i guess i mean i don't know if that's the actual like explanation but this brand protects you for all of them i think again i'm not sure but basically it's just a really really good and reliable um tanning brand and it also can enhance your melanin so you tan easier as well this was a couple of days ago so i'm just like really not what i can remember but yeah i'm really excited to try those and they also gave me this swimsuit um which is like it looks tiny but it's really stretchy and it's from the brand beach flamingo so yeah i'm so excited i've got so many new bits for this trip uh, i feel like packing is going to be fairly easy because i've got loads of new bits sitting in different bags and to be honest with you because we're going for a week and it's literally just chilled sunbathing all inclusive in the hotel i'm not too worried about like looking fancy all the time obviously i'm going to take a few photo um a few outfits for some content and stuff but other than that i'm not like too too stressed about packing um so yeah and also i don't know if i've mentioned i'm actually going with my cousin um so yeah it's just going to be a cute girls trip so i'm going to open my case make some piles and start packing basically and i'm not not going to talk you through it because i did that in my last packing video so if you are interested on like my packing techniques <laughs> tips um then you can go watch that video okay update what is the time actually the time is half past four no half past five and i've been doing this for a couple of hours but on and off to be honest guys i think this is the fastest i've packed <laughs> and also possibly the neatest i mean it doesn't look that neat right now i've sort of like gone through things again um and double checked but in this side i've got outfits all clothes daytime nighttime just some extra casual bits i still need to put my trainers somewhere um but they're just for the gym in this side i've got uh all my bikinis all of my underwear i think i need to put a couple more pairs of socks in actually um hair dryer you can probably see that bucket hats or hats in general um my beach bag and i've put my sun creams in a bag in that so they don't spill in case there's any accidents and then i've also got my shoes in there as well um as as well as like hair stuff um in another pouch and again if you watch my packing for thailand video you will see how i organize all of that and over here for now this is just what i've left out um towards the airport so i've just got some jeans like some beige ones a little top um undies a cap a hoodie some lip balm perfume glasses brush and then these are just like other essentials i'm thinking i probably will put it in this canvas bag um my passport and yeah a few other things that i need to pack but i've sort of left them out because i probably will use a lot of them tonight makeup remover and things like that but um oh my god uncut jams and things like that um but i put on some makeup as well and i hope you guys can see that i definitely am looking blonder 
what do we think i also really i think i mentioned this i really want to go ginger in the winter um my sister actually also wants to do it when she saw the photo she was like should we do it together and i was like yeah i'm gonna wrap this video up here because i'm pretty much ready oh ready for tomorrow now i'm so excited and i've been on facetime to phoebe as well my cousin who i'm going with um for a bit just going through things that we might have missed but yeah i think we're all pretty organized for a last minute packing job i feel really organized so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i guess my next video what will my next video be i think it's what i eat in a week and then next week sometime there will be my turkey vlog so i hope you guys are excited i know i am and yeah thanks for watching again i will see you in my next video Bye.